हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन केस यू हैव फिल्ड अप द फॉर्म फॉर मुख्यमंत्री विज्ञान प्रतिभा परीक्षा व्हिच इज एमवीपीपी देन यू आरंट लेफ्ट विद टू मेनी डेज नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू सम टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स टू क्रैक दिस एग्जामिनेशन नाउ एज यू नो दैट द एग्जाम इज शेड्यूल्ड ऑन 19th ऑफ दिसंबर 2021 सो ऑल दोस स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ दिल्ली स्कूल्स हैव फिल्ड अप द फॉर्म देन यू नीड टू वर्क ऑन सर्टेन एरियाज इन केस यू वांट टू बिकम अ एमवीपीपी और मुख्यमंत्री विज्ञान प्रतिभा परीक्षा स्कॉलर सो फर्स्ट थिंग फर्स्ट इन लास्ट फ्यू डेज यू नीड टू कॉन्सेंट्रेट ऑन दिस कंपोनेंट ऑफ मैथ व्हिच इज मेंटल एप्टीट्यूड और मेंटल एबिलिटी टेस्ट एंड आई एम श्योर दैट यू आर अवेयर ऑफ द फैक्ट दैट द पेपर पैटर्न फॉर एमवीपीपी हैज चेंज इन लास्ट वन ईयर इनिशियली द नेम वाज चेंज एंड आल्सो द पेपर पैटर्न वाज चेंज सो देयर आर टू सेक्शंस यू आर वेल वर्स्ड विद इट वन इज मैथ व्हिच इज मेंटल एबिलिटी टेस्ट which comprises of 100 questions from verbal and non verbal reasoning from quantitative aptitude and from data interpretation now to be very fair and frank with you yeah, the differentiator in terms of you be becoming a mvpp scholar is going to be on the basis of how good you are in this section which is math because sat basically all the students would be equally good in that because that is something which comprises of the syllabus which is taught inside the school or in your classroom basically so math you need to concentrate more on math will comprise as i said questions from reasoning quantitative aptitude and data interpretation in reasoning there are certain topics in which you need to be good in like for example uh, in last 15 days i'll not recommend you to do all the topics all 20 25 topics of math but you need to focus on topics wherein you will be getting most of the questions like for example if i talk about 90% of the questions in math section will are going to be there from series which can be number series or alphabetical series there will be questions from blood relation there will be questions from uh, direction sense test there will be questions from clocks calendars cubes and cuboids this is as far as the verbal part of it then from non verbal reasoning again you will have questions from counting of figures you have question from paper cutting paper folding so the embedded figures these are another topics which are important as far as the math component is concerned then there will be certain questions from quantitative aptitude now in case you want to know what is quantitative aptitude it is nothing but uh, questions of mathematics from 7th 8th 9th 10th or 9th in fact but with a very strong blend of logic so these are logical based questions on maths so the in case you want to crack these questions the talent which is required is to think out of the box you should not be restricting yourself or holding yourself back in terms of doing it conventionally because doing it conventionally may be very tedious and time consuming and here in what is going to play a very vital role in terms of you becoming a mvp scholar is time anyone who is able to crack these question within less than 1 minute would be able to do more number of question with higher accuracy and your chances of becoming a scholar will be very high so time plays a very vital role so focus on all these topics that i have talked about these are of prime importance if you fo uh, focus more on it your probability of uh, cracking this will enhance moving back to another section which is sat uh, as you know that sat is nothing but there are 40 question from science which is nothing but physics chemistry and bio 20 from mathematics and 40 from ssc which is economics civics geography and history of class 8 and 9th level so nothing much just go on and brush up your science social science and maths of 8th and 9th level what you are doing for your 9th class uh, preparation focus on that which is again important so this is as far as preparation part is concerned but something which is very important is that also you also need to go through the previous year paper i'm not saying talking about paper which has appeared in the year uh, 17 18 or 19 because that was on a older pattern so i would strongly recommend you to go through the latest paper pattern which was there last year the exam which was conducted in 2020 only uh, 2021 in the month of march and in the description box i'll be giving a, a free online mock on math and sat which is on the basis of the exam which is going to be conducted on 19th of december 2021 please go through it because that will give you a clear a uh, clear reflection of the exam which you are expecting on 19th of december so uh, uh, do appear in that mock very thoroughly 
and if possible in next 15 days try to take at least three to four mocks on a very uh, because that's going to give you a clear reflection of what you're going to face on 19th December. So this is very important. Focus on all these critical areas that I've talked about. Don't typecast yourself solving one particular type of problem only, but your diversity and variety in topics that I've talked about is going to go a long way in terms of enhancing your performance. And whatever mocks that you're take, taking, do analyze them, uh, extract some takeaways, and whatever mistakes that you will be committing in these mocks, try not to replicate them in the actual D day, which is on 19th of December. So stay focused, stay tuned, and um, do all these um, activities that I've talked about. Concentrate on important topics, write a lot of mocks, analyze them. If you have done that very judiciously in the last 10 to 15 days, your probability of becoming an MVPP scholar will be very high. And all the best. And uh, uh, I'm sure that if you uh, uh, stick to all these uh, uh, tips that I've talked about, you'll be able to do well in this examination. All the best. And thank you for watching.